And hello, welcome to Trash Talk Let's Play. I'm your host, Austin, and I'm here with my co-host, Travis. Travis, how are you doing? Oh, you know, good as always. Nice. No complaints. Well, what was that? A week or two ago, we uploaded our Punisher review of the Netflix show, where we, along with Jose and Luis, reviewed the Punisher show on Netflix, which was a good episode, right? It was fun. I, I really enjoyed it. Yeah, and in that, I announced... The day after we're going to be uploading that, we'll be uploading a Trash Talk Close Play where we play an original like Sega Punisher game, which is what we're doing now. And we did record it, but apparently I talked the whole time in a mic that wasn't actually recording anything, so you could not hear half of us. So we're doing a re-record for the first time. Do you remember us playing this at all, or not really? Uh, Vaguely, but I know we were both so... Plastered. It only lasted about what was it, five to six minutes. Yeah, it wasn't very long. There you go. Punch. I like how Ness just a puncher, but he just punches people. Well, I guess I'm doing a little bit better. Yeah. There you go. Yeah, you get some of that turkey out of the barrel. It sounds sanitary. Yeah, I mean it's it's healthy for you, you know. Wow. <laughs> Right. Well, I guess that barrel's gone. How do you pick up stuff again? X? No. I mean Z. Oh? No? no? Okay. There, there we go. go. Yeah, so in this, the main villain is Kingpin, apparently, but we go up against people like Bruno, who I had to look up, is apparently the guy who killed Punisher's family. So that's nice. The last time the main villain in that episode that we tried to record was our alcoholism. <laughs> yeah, no. Big flaw. And also, uh, Technical issues. Well, I mean, these wow. knife throwing guys are kind of a pain. I like how you're going up against these guys with bats and knives, and you're just like, I'm going to punch this guy. Oh, and he just threw a knife at me. Okay, nice. respawn. Oh, knife throwing. No, these you... guys have amazing accuracy with their knives. Can you jump? I this? can vaguely, but it's, uh, yeah, there we go. Oh, yeah, there we go. You can't shoot your gun? No, because I don't have one. I have to pick one up off the ground, which is kind of annoying. And the Punisher, he is pretty good in hand-to-hand -hand combat, so that kind of makes sense. Yep. It just kind of sucks that you're going up against these guys with weapons and you just got your fists. And the Punisher is known to just whip out Glock and pop them. Yeah, no, not really his style. But, I mean, for what it is, like, the, the game that it is, it's kind of fun. Yeah. I like the kung fu kick you did into the bus. This long ass bus. Oh my god! Oh, oh this is where we get to meet Bruno. Yeah. Do oh, these guys have, have great axes. They do, and I almost picked one up, but as it turns out, I don't get to hold it for very long. Now this Bruno guy's like Dwayne the Rock Johnson size. Look at this guy. He's got the flash speed too. He's the ultimate killing machine. Oh, I just body slammed that motherfucker right that there. Was nice. Oh man, this Bruno's a tough guy. Oh, nice. Oh, he can. What, what's his with teleporting ability here? I don't know. It's just like a Mortal Kombat game. Like, why is there so many motherfuckers that teleport? I like that guy in the front is just like, you know, I'm gonna do my thing and go <laughs> drive this bus. Well, I mean, you know, he's he's a professional. He's, he's gotta, gotta keep this job. <laughs> Have kids and a family. You know, I respect this bus driver for doing his job, at least. Yeah. He's got a Kung Fu Ninja team in the back just fighting the Punisher. Punisher's just throwing jabs out there. <laughs> He's Mike Tyson out here. He punches so hard, explosions happen into the yeah, ground. That's the Punisher style. <laughs> you know what it really is. All right, I'll let you take on stage two. All right. Uh, looks like we didn't do terrible on our score. I mean, I don't even know what these numbers mean. No, not a clue. Season we one. have money, food, and weapons. Tell me where your boss is. I just threw him out of the bus. Yeah, I mean, he'll probably come back later. That's how these villains always work. Yeah. I always wanted to Bruno see. Bruno won't escape me. He threw him out of a bus. That wasn't really <laughs> escaping. <laughs> that was him being a dick. But now you're going after him again. Before going after Kingpin, I guess. Nice. I think that's the rule. Yo, call. why do we have to deal with people with great axes? I don't know. Adapt to modern civilization. <laughs> We're still in the Bronze Age. 
We've got some frog motherfucker just jumping around. I think it's a wannabe ninja. I didn't want to throw my dagger. What? Have, what is this? They have fire breath. Somehow. What is this? What did you put? He, he's a tornado. Oh, these guys have Tommy guns? That's not really a fair fight, but... Punisher likes the odds stacked against him. Yeah, he does. Luckily, these guys have no aim, so it works. Help me. I'm the Punisher. If I could, I would just shoot you in the face right now. And who's this, like, Joseph Stalin-looking ass guy in the painting? That's a good question. Maybe it's Ow, their maybe... wannabe kingpin? Yeah. Oh, that's true. Maybe it's just kingpin. Oh, my God. What? Oh. He has a flamethrower. I forgot about the flamethrower. <laughs> I'm even... on fire. It's not a good flamethrower, either. It's like a really crappy flamethrower. It's like a fire extinguisher. Yeah, with flames. Uh, that's okay. our second life. All right, you up now, Tress. All right, let's give this a go. Oh, I forgot about the flamethrower. <laughs> Seriously. Apparently there are three uses on the that's, that's, of the great axe, because yeah. that's how they work. Yeah, I know. They, they run out of ammo. Yeah. I can attack one more person with this, and it's useless. Yeah. That That's great. I love the ammunition on a sword. I'm glad smiths are building swords for such great use that they can only use three times before they break down. What is that, some like Walmart katanas? What yeah. is this bullshit? It's actually it's probably... Better than a Walmart katana, but not by much. Yeah, that's true. Hey, we made it a little bit farther. Look at that. I, what? The Bruno? Wait, what? What the fuck is this Power Ranger shit? <laughs> to, what? What is this? <laughs> this is not a fair fight. What is this? Oh my god. Is this Bruno from the comics or something? I don't know. I had to look up Bruno. I'm pretty sure they made him up for the game. Why are we going up against like a Megazorg or whatever they're called from Power Rangers? I can't even hit this guy. He's, I do like no damage. How do we go from just beating up guys with katanas to this? Oh. It's not fair. You don't even have a gun. Oh, and this guy looks like he does. <laughs> oh, this is going to be close actually. Oh, no. No, it's not even nowhere near close, because unless I have an extra life, which I might. You got him on the ropes. Somehow I'm actually doing damage to this guy. You did it somehow with, like, no life. What? Stage what? two. That is stage two. What? Drug dealer going down. Hells yeah. Let's go get some cocaine. Where's that gun during the actual play? Uh, it was it was in your pocket the whole time. What's up, my ass? Where was it when I was fighting a Megalozork? Well, it's in your pocket again because you can't use it. I kind of wish it would show me how much ammo I got for this. No, don't put away the gun. I don't want to punch it. What? This guy's back again? Fuck you, Bruno. It won't even let you pick up. Oh yeah, there you go. Pick up the Uzi. Shoot this guy. Oh, this is Heat or Gus? Maybe? G no, I think it's Gus. Well, I'm glad I'm going up against iconic Punisher villains such as Gus. <laughs> and, the, and the Zorg. There we go, knife time. Go back and pick up the food if you can. Who the fuck is this? This is Red. Wow, they just got lazy <laughs> with it. They're like, uh, what are we going to name this random guy? I don't know, he got a red suit. Let's name him Red. Yeah, big muscular red guy. Red and Gus. Bit of a meathead. I pick up that food. It might give you some extra health. There you go. A little bit more health. So you can beat Red to a pulp with your bare hands, even though you have a gun sitting in your pocket. No, oh, no, one of them's still alive. Bang, bang, bang. What was that? Oh, more of them. We got Golly. Yeah, baby. Pick up that M16. There yeah, you go. Yeah, baby. Why am I going up against like Vietnam veterans? Now it's useless. Now you got a knife, and now that's useless. Look at that. Uh, looks like you're up. Game over. What? Wow, it bring us 1993-94. I wasn't even born yet. Oh, neither was I. Wow. Well, what did we learn today? Uh, this game is more difficult than it looks, but it is fun. Yeah, And yeah. it makes no sense whatsoever, both story-wise and the kind of, like... <coughs> Practically? <laughs> yeah. N not being able to pick up certain weapons or not being able to pick them up quick enough or whatever. Yeah. Oh. But no, definitely fun. Definitely yeah. good to check it out, see what you think. Sure. Well, hopefully people enjoyed this episode. 
I'm gonna go down and beat these guys up as I do my thing. Actually, Travis, you take over. Yeah, whatever, I'll do that. Hopefully, you enjoyed this. We, yeah, I guess we enjoyed this. Oh that yeah, was fun. That was fun. Um, yeah. So if you enjoyed this, subscribe. Did you get a pizza out of a plant. That's how they do it. That's okay. how they do it in Little Italy. Oh well, yeah, I mean if that's where they hide them. I, I respect. Yeah. Another plant. Oh, you didn't get a pizza out of that storm. one. storm. You don't storm in refrigerators anymore, Travis. Well, you think you would, but I guess not. So yeah, if you enjoyed this, subscribe to our channel, Trash Talk Podcast. We upload. We try to upload weekly episodes of our podcast where we talk movies, comic books, TV shows, games, all while drinking. And sometimes we also do Trash Talk Let's Play, which is what you're watching now. And sometimes reviews, but I haven't done that yet. And by done that yet, I mean I haven't gone around to it because I've been lazy. He's a very big procrastinator, but... It's true. But yeah, we had fun. Hopefully you had fun. Stay tuned for next time. I don't know. I... Travis, I'm going to let you end this episode. I don't even have an ending because I've been kind of focused on this game, but... Yo. To all, have a good night, and we will see you next time on Tra- God, I messed that up so bad. Trash Talk right. Podcast. <laughs> All right, cool. Peace out, guys.